Hey guys, did you miss me? It's been like a week since I've posted a video. <sighs> I have just been busy and doing other things and um, didn't have the chance to sit down to film anything. Uh, so today, if you guys already read the title, I am giving you guys January and February's Ipsy Bag Unboxing. I totally forgot to do a video last month of my Ipsy bag. So this is what this one looks like. And my nails are still wet. Mm -hmm, great. Hopefully I don't mess them up. I just did them. So look, I have purple and then um, this top coat. They're both Essie. This top coat is called Galantine. It's got like pink and white. Um, it's not glitter but kind of like sparkles maybe um, on it. So, and then I put a purple, um, I think it's called party something, day party. I don't know, but so they're both from Essie, but I did my nails today, finally redid them. And so I used this from my uh, monochromatic project pan, the top coat. I did use it one time this month. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into January's. So this is the little card and of course it does not say um, what we're getting. Uh, da, da, da. Beauty resolutions for your sign. So last month's was called, uh, was uh, themed Dream It for January 2021. And they have something new. It's for, it says it's, it's exclusive for Ipsy members. Um, it's called Refreshments. Um, member pricing is starting at $5. Uh, but I guess you can add different things onto your bag. So if you guys are interested, read up on that. But let's go ahead and get into the products. So first, this is our first thing. It's from Let Me Skin. And it's a deep clearing clay foam clear mild moisture so I'm assuming this is a cleanser so that is what that is a good size I think it's a cleanser but I'm gonna have to read up more oh yes this gently foam Cleanser helps clear the pores from environmental stressors while keeping the skin hydrated. So there is that. I definitely need some hydration right now. It is cold here in Ohio and snowing and it's very dry. So I definitely need that. Next is from Complex Culture. This is Good Lighting Highlighter Duo. Oh my gosh, look at this packaging. So here we go, here is our duo, so pretty. Let's do some swatches, of course, we can't have a video without swatching, ooh. So there are those, so pretty. I think both of those would look good on my skin. I think we can do with both of them. So we have something from iTem. Uh, it's an air hug concealer. Hmm. It says pull me right here. We're just gonna pull this. It didn't pull all the way. All right, this is a, I love this packaging, this ombre look here. Okay, let's see. Um, the shade they sent me was three natural, uh, light neutral. So let's see if it's, uh, oh my gosh, that's a big, um, wand applicator. Ooh, that's definitely going to be way too dark. Um, I'm probably going to have to use that as like a spot conceal and not like an under eye concealer, but that is from item beauty or item uh, next is from Glow Recipe. This is cool. It's the Watermelon Glow Lip Pop. Let's 
get this out. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's like a lipstick. Ooh. Ooh. I could smell, as soon as I, I could smell the watermelon. Mmm, that smells really good. If I didn't have anything on my lips, I would put something on. I just put some lip gloss on because my lips were chopped. But that definitely smells like watermelon. I cannot wait to put this on. So cool. All right, and the last thing from the January box is from Studio Makeup. Uh, this is a Silk Hydration Face Primer. Love trying new primers out. So that is a good, good size. Um, I'm going to be coming back probably next week sometime um, to test any of the makeup items that we have um, in the video today. I am going to do a video of me testing all of this stuff out. Um, I did that last um, in December. I did that in December and I seem to, I liked doing that video. So, all right, next, this is for February. This is, uh, send love is the, um, yeah. Hashtag Ipsy send love is the, um, theme. I could not think of the word I was coming with. And this bag is so cute. It's red and it's got like um, hearts all over, or not hearts, um, kisses, kisses, like lips all over it. So the first thing we're pulling out is from First Aid Beauty. And I just freaking spit on the From First Aid Beauty, this is the Gentle Foaming Face Cleanser. Um, lifts away dirt, oil, and debris. This might be one that uh, is going to live in my shower. So excited to have another face cleanser. We have we have two face cleansers we can try out. Next up, we have something from Cali. Cal Cali. This is a whipped moisturizing cream for normal to dry skin. Apply to the entire face and neck, avoiding eye area, morning and night. Soften skin without leaving a heavy, greasy feeling. Aloe vera gel soothes and almost seems to protect skin, while green tea leaf extract quenches skin from the inside out and keeps plump up. Keep blah, 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 blah. inside and out and helps plump up skin. So, there is that. Next thing is from Beauty Stat. Uh, we've been getting a lot of new brands I've never heard of. This is an Ultra uh, Universal C Skin Refiner. It brightens, retexturizes, and firms. So, here is what the bottle looks like. And... Cool. It is like a little pump thing. So I will have to test that out and let you guys know how I like that. All right. Next, we have a brow gel from. It says We Are Fluid. And it's a browsy. We got something. Oh, it was like a lip gloss or something. It was a clear one, but it looked purple. That was from this brand. And I really liked it. It's actually, I think it's almost gone. But we have a brow gel to test out. And the very last thing is this, if you can see it. It's from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And it's the Luminous Foundation. I have the shade 140N. So we are going to see if this is a good shade match um and it does say it's a medium coverage foundation with luminous natural finish so here is what the bottle looks like and let's see we're gonna do it on this side we're gonna see 
kind of liquidy. I don't know, guys. I don't know. That looks like it. Mm, on the camera, it doesn't look too bad. But in person, it kind of, kind of looks too orange, maybe. I don't know. We're going to have to test it out on the skin, though. So come back and um, look for that video. But that is everything from my January and February Ipsy bag. Um, I'm sorry that um, this is kind of later going up, but at least I got I got it up for you guys. Um, uh, yes, yeah, so stay tuned for a trying, um, trying testing my makeup from my Ipsy bags. Um, that will probably be out next week sometime. I'll try to have to film, film it while the kids are in school. But I hope everyone has a good day. And I will see you guys on my next video. Bye, guys.